Welcome to Cricket Victoria's Coaching Clips. I'm Cricket Victoria Academy coach, Sean Flegler. In this clip, we're focusing on finger spin bowling. Finger spin is commonly referred to as off spin or left arm orthodox spin. The grip, place the ball between the forefinger and middle finger which is spread, with an emphasis on using the forefinger to spin the ball. Ensure the grip is not too loose, but not too tight. The fourth and fifth fingers can be folded into the palm and the thumb can rest loosely on the ball. Approach. Balanced and rhythmical, the approach should build momentum towards the target. Gather. Ensure that the jump in the gather is directed towards the stumps at the batter's end. During the gather, the bowler is encouraged to have high arms in their load-up to create energy. Feet alignment. Generally, for a finger spinner, the back foot should land parallel to the return crease. The front foot should land at 45 degrees, allowing for a pivoting motion during the action. Action. The bowler should have a strong front arm, pulling the elbow down to the hip to trigger the action. One key to the action is a braced front leg which allows the bowler to drive up and over with the back leg coming through simultaneously with a fast arm. Release. For the stock delivery the bowling arm should be high but not so high that the bowling arm touches the ear. The release for the finger spinner stock ball should see the palm of the bowling hand facing the bowler's head. The follow through should take the bowling arm past the opposite ribs which ensures the action has been completed. Once completing the action it is important that the bowler is ready for the return catch. Variations. The top spinner should have more overspin with the seam rotating towards the batter, hopefully dipping and bouncing straight on. For the arm ball, the ball is released straight from the forefinger rather than with any spin being imparted on the ball and is designed to travel straight on with the arm. Thanks for watching Cricket Victoria's Coaching Groups. 